Hello friends of YouTube, Laurie and Witch here with your weekly reading. This is going to cover the 5th of October to the 11th of October. We've got the Archangel Oracle deck by Doreen Virtue. I was going to do some crystal work but they're still soaking up the light of the moon. Um, so I'm just going to make do with this and my nice candle here that maybe you can't see because my webcam is not very good. Um, but I do hope the blood moon um, was very good to you. It'd be interesting to share or hear some experiences that you had with regards to the blood moon. Um, for me it was very, actually very um, intense um, and I stayed up until about 4am to see it. So it's going to be interesting to see now how it's sort of manifest into the next few weeks and see what's going on. Um, so we've got the Archangel Do Oracle deck by Doreen Virtue. Um, I just thought it would be a change just to shuffle them and, and kind of show how I work a little bit. Um, generally get, get that feeling across for everybody. So I'm just going to start shuffling now, focusing on the energy of next week. Mercury retrograde, I tell you, that is really kicking a lot of technology lately. Um, it's been really um, kicking me, <laughs> really, um, with regards to electronics, messages, emails, videos, trying to get new apparatus in order to work properly. Two and a half hours this morning on a brand new item to um, technical support. So that's the kind of thing that I think is going to continue over the next few weeks. Okay, but that's very good considering what the blood moon meant. And there we go. Do you think I should do another one? I think I should do another one. Ooh, right, okay. So I'm just going to read this. So this is Archangel Raguel, Relationship Harmony. The angels, oh sorry, we angels are opening the hearts of everyone involved. Arguments and conflicts are being resolved now. So this I believe, if we can, this I believe is in relation to anything. Family, friends, relationships. This applies to everything. The blood moon basically went down into your psyche, into your soul brought up anything that maybe you had suppressed slightly and now it's asking you to take ownership of that. Um, so with this one I believe it also is with these two. Um, so relationship harmony is going to be upon you now. If you want anything sorted you can get this sorted. If you want to speak to somebody and get something resolved it can be resolved because if you breathe you'll be fine if you take the time not to raise your voice to not let other people anger you you know um that sort of feeling of people can push your buttons just try not to let people push your buttons um i mean even this one this is archangel raphael so this is take several deep breaths and exhale slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns I was reading that upside down. Um, so release all patterns. Make sure that you take the time and just again breathe, meditate. Make sure you're focused in every conversation with a loved one when you're trying to organise um, how you both are together. Um, I believe a lot of people have been confused recently. I've seen it happen. Um, why are these people giving me dirty looks? Why am I not being invited here? Why am I not? Those questions are going to be answered and you may not like the answer that you receive but at the same time I feel it is going to be something that you can work through um, and also beloved one so this is Archangel Camberwell I am helping you with your spiritual soulmate relationship and there we go so soulmates a lot of preconceptions are that it's just romantic it's not it is also um, friendships family you know they, they can be soulmate relationships so if you have had a very stark time with a person that you love recently that you really care about it's going to be resolved within this first week of october the main reason i feel is because libra is kind of the relationship sign and with the release that was opposite libra in the blood moon it's all about balance it's all about harmony trying to work together to reach the common goal that you both feel one with each other um 
so yeah this the main feeling that I get is harmony it's balancing it's m making the time and it's also trying to work through something meaningful it's an, a frivolous time it's a time to make your words count for something so you've got three beautiful angels here you've got three aspects of this next week in Libra um, it is a time for the blood moon to create this change and create this sort of flow between these not one of these is first do that first do that then you do that it's all together so it is something that you really need to work on I feel um, as always I have my personal readings they're still on offer until the 9th of October so you've got all next week if you want to catch up and see what your own personal future holds um, I'm still got patreon thank you to those already who have supported me on patreon um, really helps investing in the site I'm hoping to get a new tarot deck soon um, I'm being called to use something different um, and just add something on here and for those of you who subscribe comment look at my Facebook page Twitter all that kind of stuff thank you so much it's really nice um, and the main I keep getting drawn to this it's, it's almost like the spiritual thing so this is kind of the cosmic waves coming through for you and um, I hope that a lot of us can really settle in with this energy that's coming through I'd be happy to help anyone who needs it but in the meantime take care of yourself I'll be back with a weekly reading next time and um, actually I was going to ask you so feedback time if you would like a daily reading you know if you'd like me to start doing daily readings or um, separating some readings into love and then into other things because I don't always get the love vibe from monthlies because um, I'm kind of trying to get the messages that people need to hear so just let me know if there's anything in particular that you'd like to see this channel do um, I'm all for helping people so if there's something that you may want to do I do astrology so if you wanted to get some astrology predictions as well for the month I could do that um, but just let me know how you feel and ha let me know what you'd like to see you can email me or message me that's fine um, but yeah that's your reading for next week take a lot of deep breaths understand that the relationships will always have to be worked on and that harmony will come through with communication so i wish you all the best to find out the ways to get in contact me with me below and take care of yourself